It seems that Meghan Markle's Hollywood dreams are facing another embarrassing setback, and this time the spotlight isn't shining on her at all. Recently, the Duchess of Dismissal found herself noticeably absent from one of the most talked about charity events of the year. Hosted by none other than Hollywood icon Kevin Costner, this annual gathering, a glittering affair that usually draws a host of A-listers, turned out to be a glaring reminder of how far Meghan's plummeted from a once coveted position. Months ago, Meghan was buzzing with excitement about her grand return to Tinseltown, teasing numerous projects that would set the world ablaze. Fast forward to today, and all we have are lukewarm promos for a polo documentary and a cooking show that seems to have boiled down to nothing but hot air. While Prince Harry seems to be thriving in his entertainment ventures, Meghan's efforts appear to be sinking faster than a lead balloon. Sources close to the situation revealed that Meghan initially toyed with the idea of attending the event with Harry. However, in a surprising twist, she ended up being a no-show. Officially, she claimed to be under the weather, but insiders whisper that a decision was more about a bruised ego than an actual illness. After all, who wouldn't want to dodge yet another public humiliation? Last year, Meghan attempted to commandeer the microphone from Costner at the very same event. The look on his face was priceless. He clearly wasn't keen on sharing the stage with the former royal, who was desperately trying to steal the spotlight. Harry fought to ensure that his wife had a moment, but the audience was left cringing at the awkwardness. It's no wonder that the memory of that moment haunted Meghan's thoughts as she weighed her options this time around. This year, the event took a different turn. Harry was slated to present an award solo, a role that Meghan may have been desperate to snag. However, word on the street is that the organisers were having none of it. Clearly, Meghan's Hollywood stock has dropped dramatically, and rather than face the music, she chose to stay home and nurse her pride. Meanwhile, Harry seemed to be positively glowing without Meghan by his side. He engaged effortlessly with guests, his body language exuding joy and relief as he basked in the limelight, free from the burden of being Meghan's emotional support. Can we blame him? He was finally able to connect with the audience without the pressure of Meghan's antics hovering overhead. The real kicker. Meghan likely fearing being overlooked or, heaven forbid, not recognised at all. She wasn't about to take a back seat to Harry just as he's often done at her events. Instead, the charity gala allowed Harry to shine independently, a refreshing change from the usual dynamics of their relationship. And just think about the conversation that must have taken place when Harry returned home. Guess what, dear? I went to a star-studded event and you weren't invited. Ouch, that must have stung. It's a stark reminder of the shifting sands beneath Meghan's feet as she grapples with a waning celebrity status. In the end, Kevin Costner continues to demonstrate his prowess as a Hollywood powerhouse, while Meghan finds herself yet again sidelined. As she navigates the murky waters of her Hollywood ambitions, the spotlight grows dimmer. Perhaps it's time for her to reflect on what may have been if she hadn't tried so hard to be the centre of attention.